Hello guys, what's up? We're back with another video and today we're just going through well, is the National League the most competitive league? I mean, it's two games in and every team has dropped points. Like the most points someone a team is on is four. Uh Notts County and Solly Hill are uh drawn for a top spot. But is it the most competitive it's ever been? I mean, so far, literally anyone could win it. Like, even Aldershot, and we're bottom. But generally, it. I am, so far, two games in, I am looking forward to this National League. Like, this is the league you should be watching. Not the Premier League. Um, this this is the most... My new Premier League actually, actually looks all right this season, kind of. Um, but yeah, I think this is a league you need to be watching. Uh, so anyway, let's do the results. Woking 2, Dagenham and Redbridge nil. I don't like Woking. I'm an Aldershot fan. Made me very depressed. They won 2 nil. Next. Bromley Altrincham nil nil. Very, very exciting game. One yellow card. Um, I don't really know what happened. I wasn't there, and you do. It's kind of hard to find highlights for national league games, unless you go on like the club site. Uh, Chesterfield won all the shot nil. We played really well. In my opinion, we deserved a point. Like for definite. Um, I thought we played really well. Um, but unfortunately Chesterfield made the most of their chances, got one, came close, definitely, um, yeah, easily won Woodstone nil, again, not as bad as Woking, I don't hate Eastley as much as Woking, but, God, I am not happy that Eastley won, and I actually kind of rate Woodstone, I mean, they've got... My favourite player from last year, Kinsella. Why aren't they playing him? Kinsella's an absolute beast. Get him in your team. Um, yeah. Mind you, they've also got Kreshmar, so I don't know if I like them because he scored two against us. But we won that game 3 2, so iconic game. Um, yeah, 1 0. Uh, Yeovil 1, Wrexham 1. Um, Wrexham, will they get promoted? Like, you know, they've spent all this money, um, but will they get promoted? Like, one all with the overall. But it is very difficult, the National League this year. Bournemouth 2, Notts County 2. Uh, 82nd minute penalty for Bournemouth. Um, managed to get a draw. We've got them next week. Uh, no. Today, <laughs> about next week, we got them today. Um, next week, uh, we got them today. Um, so hopefully we can get something out of that. Um, Maidenhead Scunthorpe, Maidenhead actually won that, and I put them second bottom. So I look like a fucking idiot now, don't I? Oh. And mind you, they, they almost bottled that. Like, they were 3-0 up in the first half. And Scumdorp had about, what, seven minutes to um, get the equaliser. They got the set their second goal in the 87th minute. Maidstone. Maidstone are actually doing well. I put them for bottom. Bottom. And they're sixth, I know. I know it's only two games. Um, against York, who I actually... I think I put York playoffs. Um, I think they'll do well. But yeah. 2-1 Maidstone. Solihull, Southend. I think I... I put Solihull... Play, I put Solihull playoffs, yeah. So 1-1. One, one, um... It's all right. I mean, it's early doors. Uh, South End, I thought, would do a little better than they did last year. But I'd say they haven't had the best of starts. I mean, 21st, again, early. But 
the run they had last season was insane, so I kind of expected them to do a little better, but I suppose it is what it is. Uh, Gates had two, Barnett two. Gates had, uh, I mean, they what had two tool draws, um, but yeah, I think the promoted teams have been really competitive. Um, Maidstone, York, Dorking, and Gateshead. So that is good to see that it's just not straight up than straight down. Um, they do look competitive, to be honest. And um, Barnet have been doing really well. I tip them for relegation. What am I doing? Oh, God. Um, then Halifax, nil. Torquay won. I put Torquay for winning the playoffs. Uh, again, I didn't watch the match. Um, I only watched uh, all the shots match. Um, but yeah, what's happening to Halifax so far? Like... I mean, they were doing really well. They had playoffs last year. I don't know if they're burnt out. I don't know what the squad's like. I don't know if it's just been a poor start. I mean, I suppose... I mean, Barney, you'd expect them to win that first game. Torquay, fair enough. Um, and then last game, the the late kickoff for that day, Oldham 3, Dorking 2. Great game. Um... Uh, Oldham took a 3-0 lead, and then Dorking got two back in the 82nd and 86th minute. Dorking's a team, I think, quite an exciting team. They seem to really play quite attacking. Like, I don't know what their defence is like, but it seems... I mean, I think there was some, like, documentary thing on Dorking. Like, some of their games and stuff. Um... Yeah, I'd say quite a good attacking team. I mean, they've had a 2 all with Chesterfield and a 3-2 against Oldham. Uh, Oldham have looked all right. I think I did put Oldham... Yeah, I, I think I put... Did I put Oldham playoffs? I can't remember. Um, but Scunthorpe I put quite low down. And my new Scunthorpe by 11th. But I do feel like they might struggle. I'm not sure. It might be fine, I don't know. Um, but yeah, that's pretty much uh, National League Roundup. I might do this more if you guys like these videos. I do enjoy doing football videos. Um, but yeah, uh, so yeah, match day three. Um, I'll just do my predictions quick. Uh, Woking, so Woking Scumthorpe, I'm saying 2-2. Two, two. Uh, Bournemouth, Aldershot, I'm going to say... I say one one. I take I take a point at Bournemouth. I think that'd be a good result. Uh, Torquay Bromley. I'm saying two on Torquay. Chesterville Wrexham. I'm going one nil Wrexham. Eastley Dagenham. Dagenham have not had a good start. Um, again, only two games in. I I think I've said that too many times this video. Um, I'll go one one in that. Gates had not county. Um. I like nil nil. Actually, I'll go. I'll go two on knots. I feel like knots will just edge it. Um, Maidenhead, Altrincham. I'm gonna say two on Maidenhead. I feel like Maidenhead, Maidenhead at home can be quite scary. Um, Maidstone, Dorking. I'm gonna say. I'm going to say 2-0 Dorking. I feel like Dorking will really show up this game and win 2-0. Oldham, Wildstone. Um, I think Oldham will continue their run. I'm saying 1-0 Oldham. Halifax, Southend. Um, I'll go 1-0 Southend. I feel like Halifax are going to have a rough start. I think they will recover. I wouldn't be too worried. They may not be. Uh, Yeovil, Barnet. I'm going 0-0. Then Solihull, York. Um, I'm going to go one, uh, 2 0 Solly Hole. Um, I think Solly are a great team. I think they'll do well. But yeah, that's my match day three predictions. Just thought I'd put that in there. But anyway, thank you for watching. Goodbye.